We've got some difficult days ahead. But it really doesn't matter with me now. Dr. Martin Luther because King didn't just people. have one dream. He contained multitudes, and his legacy reflected that. But is it about uh, the legacy related to him being the, the savior of the movement and American society being behind him, which definitely wasn't true? Is it the legacy of him as a leader and really being a driving force of the movement when actually the movement was sustained and led by so many women of color. One of his most noted legacies was that he dreamed of a united society. And here at Lamar, many are seeing that come true. I mean, I'm at Lamar University and I'm going to be elected SGA president. That's something that wasn't possible through in his time period. I definitely think that that progression has happened. I see that legacy in every student. Uh, I see it in our student leaders. I see it in our student organizations and all the vibrant things they're trying to do. Every aspect and fabric of our campus life includes uh, Dr. Matthew King's message and spirit. Dr. King stood for many things, and one of those things was anybody can serve. All you need is a heart full of grace and a soul generated by love. For Dr. King's dream to come to a fruition, he loved this idea of the beloved community. And that means accepting some flaws, that means accepting some wrong, but at the same time, helping others overcome them. These panel discussions are a start to building unity. This is an opportunity for people to be able to share their ideas, and uh, hopefully we come in truth and in the spirit and also in peace. That way we can actually have exchanges and not simply be comfortable with what our Facebook page may be telling us. Brooke Kirchhoff for OUTV News, Beaumont.